Hello, I'm the Franchise King, Joel Lababa. A question for you. When is harvest time for franchisees who own lawn care franchises? In this video, I'm going to tell you exactly when that is, and you may be surprised. I'm Joel Lababa, and I'm the Franchise King, and I wanted to talk quickly about lawn care franchises. You know, what are they? Lawn care franchises aren't generally franchises that do landscaping. Rather, they do fertilization, uh, bug control, they get rid of grubs. Um, some of them are even starting to branch out and are doing um, uh, mosquito killing, uh, which is always a good thing, especially in the, in the summer months when it's, uh, when it's raining. So that's what basic lawn care franchises do. And if you'll notice in your neighborhood, uh, those little flags that are always placed on the lawn, you know, keep your pets off the lawn or it's actually pet friendly, but it's been fertilized, et cetera. There's always a couple flags around. Um, the more flags on the more houses, on the more streets, uh, the more revenue is coming in. But when does that revenue come in? When, when do franchisees of, of lawn care franchise businesses actually make their money? When is harvest time? You're going to be surprised. It's not in the middle of the summer when you as a franchisee have employees doing uh, uh, the fertilization and, and the bug control and the mosquito spraying, etc. It's in January and February. What? Why is that? Well, that's because that's when you as a franchisee are going to be sending out dozens, hundreds, thousands of direct mail pieces in your territory. You're also going to be doing email marketing and you're going to send emails to prospective lawn care um, uh, customers. And this is all done in pretty much January, February. And by March, um, you should pretty much know where you're going to stand for the year because you'll have paid contracts in hand. So you're going to be really busy in January and February and March, uh, busier than you think. But you want to be busy. You want to be calling on either in person or on phone or over the phone or via email. You want to be calling on prospective customers of yours because those are the people who are going to be paying your bills for the entire year. So even though you may have thought that the franchisees of a lawn care business are making their money in the summertime, they're actually making their money when they collect their contracts and get those checks in hand. Now you know, I'm the Franchise King, Joel LaBava. Check out my website, thefranchiseking.com and the Franchise King blog for more, hopefully, useful information. And if you want to work with me, just go to thefranchiseking.com forward slash consultations so we can talk. Thanks for watching.